So my name is Liam Lynch, I work for Red Mason Heritage Masonry Services and we restore historic brickwork and traditional buildings. We undertake a lot of repointing work, a lot of lime mortar work, gauge brickwork, tuck pointing, uh, really just restoring historic brickwork to its former glory. So we're working on a 16th century property, it's a lovely English traditional kind of Georgian style farmhouse and it's, uh, its masonry is really, really traditional. It's lime mortar, it's a ruled joint and they're handmade wood-fired bricks, so very, very soft. Um, obviously a, a, a really, really nice brick, so something we want to try and save and make sure that we damage as minimal as possible. So being able to then reverse units of bricks or reverse units of masonry with the Arbitec allows us to use the exact same historic fabric of the building. We're not having to put new bricks in, we can turn around and it's actually all part of the original. We always find the all saw helps massively with cutting out work, especially reversing of bricks, uh, masonry units. It allows just that ease of uh, removing the old mortar and doing less damage to the actual aesthetic of the building, mainly the brickwork, the actual bricks. Mortar can be replaced with ease. Bricks, especially when they're a few hundred years old, can be very hard to replace. So you want to minimise the damage to those units and the all saw is just perfect at that. Well, the old saw definitely cuts out that need for, let's say, drilling or using a hammer and a chisel to just kind of implode a brick. Um, so then again, like I said before, you can then expect to save the masonry unit, also be able to get the joint depth cut out to a very precise kind of depth and just continue it all the way through the building without that need for hammer and chisel work, um, drills and just brute brute strength sometimes. <laughs> I mean I'd definitely say that the all saw helps us get our cutting out work done a lot more efficiently. It saves that kind of headache of thinking I've got to spend ages of time with the hammer and chisel and it definitely allows us to stay within budget because on some buildings you could be talking months of cutting out work and whereas an Arbitech you could get a team of you with a few saws yeah you're going to have the cost of a few sets of blades but actually you can cut that time frame down to a very smaller window which can just allow progression especially when you're up against the weather. <laughs>